So what's in this train yard? Anything interesting? Anything useful? Aside from a way out, I mean. <laughs> Good question. Kind of train crash. Yep. <laughs> exactly, yeah. Thanks for saying the obvious, Dina. <clears throat> but you're right. <laughs> okay, nothing yet. Kept these running past outbreak day. Uh, I see some light up that way. I'd say probably a few months, a few weeks, if not a couple of months, I'd imagine. <coughs> I mean, what with everyone, what with everything that's going on today, public transport is still up and running. So I mean, you know, gotta have, gotta have a way for you know? for people to commune. Coming. Hmm. Yeah. It's a fair question though. <clears throat> so why would we go back this way? <clears throat> Unless there's some very good reason. Um, okay, that was Don't know why that's there, but whatever. Yep, take that. Anything down here? Nope. Look like it. Okay, nope. Well, at least I checked. Getting closer to light. That's good. <coughs> hey, let me get you up there. Yeah. You got. You're exhausted, Dina, aren't okay. you? Let's rally. We're almost out. Right on. <laughs> Very well. A bit of ammo. Wouldn't mind some shotgun ammo, but we'll take what we can get. Hmm. Oh, jeez! Oh, God! Gosh, get the hell out of me. Oh, no! No, 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 no! No, that's it. Bad news! Bad news! No, 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 she's immune, no, I'm not infected, I'm immune, I'm not coughing, do you see, fuck, Dina, shit, oh shit, yes, let's fucking go, go, run like your life depends on it, Go! Right here. Don't, Don't stop for anything! Oh shit! 
Go! This way! Just go! Fuck! Go right! Come on! Way ahead of you! Shit! Right behind you, Dina! Go! Oh god, no! No, 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 no! No, no you don't! Holy shit! That was too close! <coughs> she is just flat out exhausted. Oh my god. They've got you. Ah, oh, feel that rain. Huh. What do you say we rest in that theater? <sighs> that sounds so fucking good. That sounds like a fantastic plan. I seriously Walter. think you're pregnant, Dina. I really do. You put all, you're showing a lot of the signs of it. I got you. Complete exhaustion. Here. So I don't think it's... <clears throat> you and Elliot are just as fit as each other, so... You're not affected. I only know of one other thing. Offhand. So you're gonna be honest with us, Dina? You wanna tell me what's going on with you? Yep. What's going on with me? <clears throat> I, I just saw you breathe spores. We told you! You just didn't believe us! I told you. Yeah! You didn't believe us. <sighs> okay. You're immune? Come on. <coughs> I was bitten a long time ago. The fuck are you talking about? I was bitten and nothing happened. The chemical burn. We told you this. She told you the story, Dina. You should have believed her. Shouldn't have thought it was a joke. Now you do, Dina. No. Now you know. She's scared to tell you because she loves you, Dina. Haven't you figured that out yet? I can't... get you infected if that's what you worry about. Well, that's a good... that's a good part. I can't make you immune either. Yeah, that's the sad part. Or downside. <laughs> What's going on with you, though, Dina? Seriously. Can you say something? Really? I think I'm pregnant. Oh, I figured. All the signs were there. Morning sickness, oh, exhaust. <laughs> what, what are we supposed to do now? Nothing. I just need to rest for a second. Are you fucking kidding? How long have you known? It was late a few weeks ago. A few weeks. You should have told us, Dina. We could have still turned back. Well, I didn't know. I wasn't sure, okay? I didn't want to be a burden. Well, you're a burden now, aren't you? Ooh. That's just out of emotions, I think. She doesn't mean it. It's emotional, Dina. Well, she doesn't think that right at that moment, though. 
I mean, I get she doesn't, you know, she, because she loves, I mean, because she loves Ellie, she didn't want to burden her with that possible information. But at the same time, I get where Ellie's coming from. Like, why would you not tell her something? Like, if you love her, why should you not tell her? Like, I, get, I get both sides. I do. I mean, if she's not sure, if she's not sure, she should confide us and say, look, you know. <laughs> I mean, it probably would have traveled, but maybe made more frequent stops to rest. I mean, you know, they could have done something about it, you know? At least made the same journey, just rested more often, you know? <laughs> okay, yeah, I know with all the clickers and everything, but even so. Wow. <clears throat> I had a feeling. But the signs were there, the... The throwing up for like basically morning sickness just exceeded exhaustion when <coughs> Ellie's not. I mean, they're both quite fit. I mean, you know, they could both run the miles if they need to. So, I mean, it wasn't that. And she wasn't actually ill per se. She wasn't infected that we could tell because that was that infection spread. Sprinkle was medical and that was infection. That was, sorry, <coughs> pregnancy. American Jack Cassandra. I've never heard of this one, actually. I've never heard of the, that one. If you actually know what that plays about, let me know. To be honest, I've actually never heard of it, surprisingly enough. <clears throat> I've heard of a fair few players in my time. Been to a couple as well, but... No, never heard of that. I mean, I've heard of... I've heard of a play called Cassandra. Keep something like that. Yeah, I, I mean, I like I said, I get from both sides. I do. <clears throat> they're both emotional. They're both frustrated. They're both tired. It's emotion talking, uh, not the pregnant. Just their reactions to each other. So, <clears throat> but I've heard of a play called Cassandra, but I didn't know anything about like a, an American tragedy or or whatever. So that they were connected. So anyway. <clears throat> September 4, me Perez Green Adams made it to the listing post two days ago. So far, so good. The wolves haven't come looking here yet. The city's lost to the wolves. We escaped heck, excuse me, escaped headquarters out of sheer luck and good timing. Torres, excuse me, Torres, Ward, and the others are probably dead. Camping here, grateful to be alive for now. Sixth, can't sleep. Burned out with a fever, no medicine. Looked everywhere. We don't even have anything except the uniforms on our backs. <clears throat> no contact from <clears throat> anyone on the radio either. How many of us made it out? Seventh. Still feverish. Don't have any big cuts, so probably not an infection. The others are waiting till nightfall. They're making a run for the, to the hospital to get medicine to be and supplies for the re for whether to that for wherever we go go next. They're good guys. Yeah. Tenth. Shouldn't be taking this long. <clears throat> okay. This note's old. Yeah. Still, better be careful. I think they've all just abandoned the place, though, to be honest. Oh, something here. <coughs> Craft anything? Yeah, why not? Wait, cut, cut. <laughs> Anything else? What's this? Shame we can't repair them, like, you know, regard. It's a bit of a shame. Was that something? No, it's only for those two. Whatever. Okay. Ooh. Let me just go over here first. Full one? Nice. Who was here before did not pick this place clean very well. <laughs> they really didn't.
Maybe one was here, they're not here now. Oh, big dead end. Okay. Oh. Oh, a card. Beyond. The hell? Oh, it's just like one of those psychic type things. Psychic type people. <clears throat> okay. Imani Graves. No affiliation. After a near-death experience that left her in a coma for two weeks, the seasoned detective found that she could cross from our world to the spirit world. Okay. So, oh, okay. It's so like a, a spirit psychic, in a sense, I suppose. Allowing her to communicate with the dead. Now known as Beyond. As beyond, she splits her time between solving murder investigations and so and serving as a spiritual medium for grieving families seeking closure. However, her fora her forays forays into the spirit world are clearly hastening her demise. She looks considerably older than her thirty five years. How much longer does she have? Oh wow. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. Feel sorry for her in that sense. That she's using her powers, she's taking a toll on her life. <laughs> Listening test. I'm guessing we might need a generator to start running, so... I'll go and deal with that first. Oh, I love the effects of the rain. They look quite realistic, actually. That's awesome. Go on, Ellie. Soak up that rain. I'll do that. Go on, let you soak up that rain for a second. <laughs> she deserves it. She really does. Oh, wow. Oh, look at, look at the, the drops of rain. Oh, like on the camera. That's amazing. Oh, that's so cool. Huh. Very realistic, actually. <coughs> oh, especially the way the rain's falling. Oh, that's realistic as hell. That's awesome. Wait, is this supposed to be... What? What? Come on, Cap. Hang up. Blech. That's pretty cool. Don't imagine it'd be like. Nope. Nothing. Cool. No problem. <clears throat> Let me guess. He electrocuted himself. Damn. You get fried? Yeah. Cool. <clears throat> Trying to do some self-made electrician work. Electrical work. Oh, well. Oh, didn't even see that there. Right, head back. Radio, I imagine. Certainly is. I'll turn that off for a second. Oh wow! <coughs> You've got a map and everything, huh? Hmm, pretty cool. Oh. Take that. Okay, map of possible places. I'll do check that in just a second. <coughs> Stember three. <coughs> I don't think they're coming back. Crossed. 
They're not coming back. Either I got ambushed or they ditched me. Not my fault I got sick. At least the fever's gone, but I'm... But I'm fucking starving. Can probably raid the buildings nearby for food. Then see if I raise someone on the radio. 15th. Constant rain means I... Means I at least won't die of thirst. True enough. Unfortunately... <coughs> excuse me. Unfortunately it keeps making the electricity conk out all the time. Makes it hard... Makes it kind of hard to use the radio. Not like anyone's answering anyway. The rules can't have... Can't have hit all the federal listening posts. No way. Need to keep trying. 16th. Drunk they were laughing as I slowly bled out from a gut shot. Woke up an hour ago, still shaking. Need a cigarette. You'd think there'd be a, a pack or two stashed somewhere in the fucking theatre. But apparently not this one. 19th. Power down again. Gonna head to the roof to see if I can get it back on. <clears throat> well, we definitely know there's no one left here. I hope you're a better soldier than an electrician. Ooh, keys. What's this? Would they be for that? Uh, well, the seating area of the theater. Uh, the yeah, I feel we. I'm pretty sure there's a special name for it. I don't want to call it the theater because the type. Yeah. It's like a word I'll just call it the seating area. This door. What do you want to bet the keys are for this? Ha! <coughs> huh, nice! All right. huh. Cool. Wow. Oh, Joel. You love watching a movie in this place. Wow. Is even collect up here? Any chance? <clears throat> Please no infected. Uh, spooky. I understand why you think that. No way. Let me guess, guitar? There you go. <clears throat> Looks in extremely good condition. Oh, well, aside from a dust that's on it, of course. <clears throat> Bit of dust on it, that's alright. Doesn't mean it's not in good nick. Doesn't sound like it's in tune. Oh, that's not in tune. Not unless you want bad sounding music. Not that I want to personally judge, I'm just saying. That's not like any guitar sound I've ever heard. She's really sorry. I think that she said to Dina, she just he can't, she just can't bring us. Doesn't know how to say it to her. Oh, flashback! <coughs> I think this is when she's about six, fifteen, sixteen. Oh, hey, Joel. <laughs> just need to build up your calluses. That's all. Yeah. All right, come on. Is it? Yeah. 
Oh, shit. oh, that's the calluses, I think. Isn't that when the the tips of your fingers get like um uh very st uh, skin okay. part? You want to spoil get very style. stiff and all that? Just the little skin, oh. almost hard, so like rough to the touch. Is that it? I'm probably wrong. Stop trying to guess. I ain't telling you. <laughs> all right. Is it an elephant? Yeah. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Is it a convertible? I, out here, really? <laughs> Is it a puppy? Um. Is it a lot of kittens? You mean a litter? Yeah, it's a litter, it's not a lot of. A bunch of kittens. Exactly. <laughs> Why wouldn't you call it just a bunch of kittens? Because that's just what they call it. It's <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I wonder how often Sarah tried to ask him this sort of stuff. Mind your step. I got it. Uh, yeah, she's gonna push her in? <laughs> of course he would. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's so Oh, I've got the breathing meter. <laughs> what is wrong with you? That was a good one, Joel. Right that's a good one. What am I drown? You're not gonna drown. I work on that confidence, kiddo. <laughs> yeah, keep laughing, old man. See what happens. <laughs> this is learning. This, this is her learning to swim, Papa. Earth. That's awesome. Okay. So Ellie can definitely swim in the game. Okay. The swim is getting better. Remember now, don't just flail about. You gotta. Push the water with your whole arm. Blah blah blah. Yeah, we know. We know. I'm getting through. <laughs> what the um. <laughs> What just what? <laughs> okay, <laughs> that was a weird texture. <laughs> okay. Oh, sorry. What was that again? Hang on. Just a mirror, look. Yeah. Yeah, just a. Yeah. Oh yeah! Wow. Looks like. Oh! <laughs> gotcha. Oh. <laughs> How's that feel? <laughs> uh. Refreshing. Yeah, it's not nice getting pushed in, is it? Well, Let me guess, so we have to go this way anyway. Actually, we need to swim through this part anyway. <laughs> yep, figured. I got you back. You're angry and upset. I am very angry and upset. Now, come on. <sighs> nah, he's just saying that to appease you, Ellie. Should know that by <gasps> Bombs away! Oh, didn't even say Geronimo. Wait a minute. God damn it. You're gonna need to dive under here. Take a deep breath. Yeah, I got this. So, is that... Okay, that's what they do in other games, so... <laughs> oh, look, this looks beautiful around here. It really does. Is it... My sixth grade history teacher wanting to apologize for being a massive dick? I seriously... I, your pardon? I seriously I doubt that he's going to be around here. Fireflies <laughs> we got a lot of detention. I can understand that. You know, you really can't stop letting people rile you up. It's hard when they're dicks. <laughs> yeah, true enough. Yeah, he's got a point as well there. Excuse me! Right, got another dive over here. Way ahead of you. Wait. Let me. God, light. Let me. Oh, so he has to be ahead. Okay, fair enough. No, oh, excuse me. Oh. Is it a new pair of sneakers? That is possible. How many of those do you have? <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> really, you had to ask a question like that. It. I'm done guessing. Well, good. But she's gonna start again, isn't she? But, like, <laughs> is it a massive comic book collection. No, wait. A new DVD collection. Not. Yes. Yes. Laser... Which one? <laughs> Just. Yes. How about laser discs? I heard that's a thing. Dinosaur. 
Oh wow. Shit, Joel. We're here. Oh my god, it is a dinosaur. Yeah, it is. Oh, that is. Joel? Surprise. That's pretty oh, cool. Shit. Oh, it's oh. a motherfucking dinosaur. <laughs> Wow, okay. We must be near a museum. Oh, wow, there you go. Wyoming Museum. How about that? The Tyrannosaurus. Tyrant lizards. <laughs> That's a big boy. <laughs> oh, 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 we've got a few things to catch up on here. Farming rotation blows. I don't get why people ask for this assignment. Note to self, talk to Maria about how early I can sign up for patrol training. Dear and I found this cool old campground today. She said kids used to get, uh, used to go there in the summer for fun. We found all these art supplies. She cut colored paper and made some crowns for us while it rained outside. It was a good day. <clears throat> Joel said he's taking me on a camping trip next week for my birthday. He found something I said I love. He's acting very proud of himself. Smuggled fogey. Cat sat next to me at movie night. Our elbows kept touching. I think she was doing it on purpose. I don't know. Maybe not. Probably. Crossed. Probably not. Didn't make me a crown for my birthday. She went back to that camp and got all this paper. It's pretty great. I was trying to read it how Ellie would read it. Probably did a terrible job at it. <clears throat> okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, we're going to the museum. Wyoming. Wyoming the museum. museum of Science and History. Oh, how did you find this place? <laughs> Maria. She, uh, she told me about it. <clears throat> Figured it'd be right up your alley. Pretty much. Figured right. Come on. What's this? Pamphlet. Uh, it's a book. <sighs> it's a dinosaur book. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> He's been that old father figure. It's like, eh, okay. You're right. No way. Akubra? Oh, we're rocking this Akubra. Oh, man. You want to try it on? I do not. Hm. You're lost. Gift shop? <laughs> oh, look at those talons. For a loss or after? Yeah. Actually, it's a D. Dionicus. <laughs> pretty sure these are velociraptors. Yeah. I mean, at least that's what they call them in this movie I saw. I don't suppose that would be Jurassic Park, by any chance? <laughs> you know, the the seri movie series. In here, <clears throat> oh, hello. Sorry, the dinosaurs are busy right now. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, wait, one of the dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> Don't, it's for you. Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> you get it? It's because you're old. No, I get it. Yeah. Not bad, Ellie. Not bad. <laughs> Uh, typical. Comsognacoth... Comsognacoth... I can't even say that. Com... Comsognathus. Comsognathus, I think. Comsognathus. Comsognathus. Ooh. Big name for little guys. Ooh, just wait till we get further on. Swarm you. <coughs> yep. 
you see that in a movie too? Actually, yeah. But a different one. <laughs> see, there's a sequel. Yep. Wasn't as good. Hmm. What's all this about? Platinum. Okay. Legacy. Presence Club. Donor Honor Wall. Okay. Gold, silver, and bronze. Huh. Giants of the past. <laughs> Triceratops. That's Stegosaurus. And I think that one over there is maybe a Brontosaurus. If I remember if me correctly. Triceratops means three-horned face. You would not want to be on the business end of that horn. Nope, you would not. <clears throat> That's absolutely certain. Ah, it is Stegosaurus. Triceratops. This is one I recognize. Really? Like, it isn't already obvious, but whatever. <laughs> Stego. Whoa, this one's brain was the size of a walnut. No, no way. Looks like you two have something <laughs> in common. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh, Brachiosaurus. Whoops. I thought there was a. Wait. The Brontosaurus is the really tall one, though, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe the one behind the Brontosaurus. <clears throat> now the Brachio is just the short, the smaller one. That, okay. That... The what? Oh, Dimetrodon. Okay. The Dimetrodon was an apex predator. It's an apex predator? Hmm. The most badass predator? Huh. Pretty short for that. Wait, were you talking about me? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, let me guess. Hat time? <laughs> Joel, look! That is a hat on a dinosaur. <laughs> it's called a hatosaur. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Oh, dear. Typical Ellie. Mimesis name means chicken mimic. I, who names these? Scientists. Scientists. Well, they're dumb. Of course, yeah. Of course they're dumb, you know. They, they, they don't know anything. Not, not compared to you, Ellie. Right. <laughs> the Nighthawk. Oh, cool. What you got there? There are. These uh, superhero cards. Seems like they were popular. I think Sarah was into those for a while. Okay. What was the little creature thing? What, you mean like Pokemon or something? Yeah. Hmm. Jerry Lavelle. When a freshly minted Air Force recruit found himself caught in a skirmish between Spark, Aerobots, and Society of Champions, his quick thinking ended up saving the day. Does to an extent, actually. With his arms and legs wounded in the battle, Doctor Stem created a set of energy wings for his arms and energy blades for his shoes, <clears throat> allowing him to cover both land and sky at absurd speeds. Together with his loyal greyhound Ezio, the small town kid known as the Nighthawk scours the world for evil doers, always ready to dive back into action. <laughs> Probably isn't going to be anything here, but I'll check anyway. <clears throat> oh, is it FaceTime? <laughs> looks like a joker, actually, in a really creepy way. A 
Okay, that's just a tad creepy, that is. That looks eerily of, like, the Joker if I'm... Oh boy. Mm. Can I get the tongue out? Nah, never mind. <laughs> you can see we're clearly enjoying ourselves, which is good. Going through there. Velociraptor. Velociraptor. Joel, this is uh, the one you were talking about, the Velociraptor? So small. Well, don't touch the movies, I guess. Hmm. Iguanodon. Allosaurus. T Rex. Oh, God. Pachycephalophorus. I can't even believe I said that more mouthful. <laughs> Look how thick this one skull is. Kinda looks like Tommy. <laughs> I'm telling you. Of so course that. you are. Please don't. <laughs> Get you in the right light. Oh, Tommy. Hmm. I think, if I remember correctly, these are the ones where they actually, if they want to have a, a fight between each other, to the mouse, they used to butt heads. I think that's what that's for. Paras... Parasaur... Par... Paras... No. Paras... Parasolophus. Parasolophus. <laughs> I'm butchering that, I'm sure. Of a raptor. Whoa, this one looks like a bird. Well, actually, paleontologists believe the birds were descended from dinosaurs. Well, excuse me, Mr. <laughs> Professor. <laughs> I happen to know a thing or two. Mm, all right. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Oh, he's still in the mar and the bird one. Okay, yeah. Hat time? Hey, is this going to be a thing? Please don't let it be a thing. <laughs> oh, you know it's going to be a thing. Joel, you know it's going to be a thing. Oh, we've got a hat. <coughs> Let's have a look at this. Yeah, I'll rock this one. Joel. Ellie. Oh. Don't you dare take it off. My birthday, and my rules. <laughs> okay. Looks good on you. That's a trophy, looks good on you. Okay. <clears throat> now I can officially both wear hats. <laughs> oh dear. Did you go to museums a lot? Yeah. Yeah, Sarah loved them. I swear that girl dragged me to every damn museum in Texas. Hmm. Okay. Looks like a giraffe. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Uh, of course he puts his on there. <laughs> I see the appeal. <laughs> Told you. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough.
All right, we're going to end it right here, and I think we're going to the space exhibit next. So, yeah, I'll see you next time. We're going to be exploring the history and knowledge of space. See you then.